As temperatures dropped across Texas, local leaders talked about climate change like the city of Austin's Homeland Security and Emergency Management Department. As we are now seeing extreme weather on a more regular basis, we should prepare for the possibility of freezing pipes in our homes. This is different from what we have been used to. The climate is behaving differently and we must adjust and change the way we prepare. But one expert doesn't believe the freezing cold was an example of climate change. And this event was really not cold at all, uh, sort of in, in the whole history of Texas. But again, the last few decades, winters have been getting warmer. So people's memories have shifted and a lot of the infrastructure has just got, you know, they've just gotten used to these warmer temperatures. Professor Andrew Dessler is an atmospheric sciences professor at Texas A&M University. He says last summer was an example, though. Oh, yeah, that's climate change. Climate change is 100 percent driving higher summer temperatures. The summer of 2023 saw a record number of days with triple digit temperatures in Texas and a NASA graph of annual temperatures over time shows 2023 was not a one off. The ERCOT grid strained under high demand in extreme heat and Dessler says it's only going to get worse if nothing is done. It's a small taste of what the future is going to be in a few decades. Last year will be the average. And, you know, by the end of the century, when my kids are, are old, uh, last summer will seem like incredibly cool. So while Dessler believes this week was not connected to climate change, preparing for the future as suggested by local leaders. The climate is changing and the way you plan for emergencies should as well. Isn't wrong. In fact, it's more important than ever. I don't think this winter storm is connected to climate change, um, but... You know, it's important to harden the infrastructure and, and because these events, with or without climate change, we're going to have cold events, so we have to be prepared for them. Thank you for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and get the latest news by downloading the CBS Austin News app.